Hi, I'm Matthew Coast, head dating coach and founder of CommitmentConnection.com. And today we're going to be talking about how to find Mr. Right. So I get this question all the time. And, you know, the first thing that I have to say is that uh, the first thing you need to do is, is avoid going to places where quality men don't go to. And so a quality man is kind of, you know, Mr. Right would be defined um, personally to you. You know, what's a quality man? What's a, what would Mr. Right be like, right? Um, and, you know, I get a lot of women who are like, well, you know, I want a guy who's, you know, this way and that way and this way and that way. And I'm like, well, where are you meeting men? And, you know, a lot of times they say I'm not at all, but, you know, sometimes they'll tell me that they're going, you know, they go out to bars, um, which, by the way, you can meet anybody at a bar, but um, there's the let you have less likely to meet a great guy who's hanging out at a bar than you are, you know, if you go to you know, a personal growth seminar or a yoga class or to, uh, you know, out on a hike or something like that. You're much more likely to find a great guy going to those places than you do, um, you know, going to a bar. Uh, so that's un unless you're looking for a bar fly and then, you know, by all means, go to a bar. So uh, the second thing is to start getting more involved in activities where you'll meet quality men. And this, uh, you know, like I said before, um, you know, find out what, you know, what a guy, so what would Mr. Right value? You know, what would be important to him? And what would a guy who values those things, where would he go? Um, and then, you know, make a list of those places. And, and if you need a list of different places to go, I've got different resources on my website and in videos and podcasts about uh, where you can go to meet quality men. Um, but create a list of those places and then start consistently going out to places like that. That's the best chance that you'll have for you know meeting a great guy. And then when you do see a guy that you like, uh, invite them to come over and talk to you. You know, most guys won't go and talk to women unless they get some kind of invitation from them because they don't like getting rejected over and over and over again. Um, only the most aggressive guys approach women uh, that they don't know. And uh, that is not the most uh, the highest quality men or Mr. Right. It's just a guy who's really aggressive. And so don't think that you're screening out uh, bad guys by only allowing guys who approach you to be the guys that talk to you um, with no invitation and, and instead give, an, give them some kind of invite. Invite them with your eyes, invite them with a smile. Um, I've even got ways to approach guys if you want to do that. Um, different resources for that on my website and videos and podcasts as well. Uh, and so the last thing is to encourage him to pursue you. Uh, when you do find Mr. Right, uh, when you do find a great guy, encourage him to pursue you. You know, show him that you like him, um, and make sure that you know he knows that you have some interest. You know, don't come on too strong, but also don't you know try to avoid him or whatever. Uh, you know, give him some kind of indication that you're interested in him, and and he will. Um, when you do that, there's a much better uh, possibility of him pursuing you that way. Uh, so that's it for this video. If you want more information on how to attract a quality man into a committed, lasting relationship, make sure you go to my website at commitmentconnection.com and take my quiz. I'm Matthew Coast, and I'll speak with you again soon.